what's up fam uh first off let me just say i'm back at y'all with another motherfucking video i told y'all what i was gonna do but uh check this out y'all i'm out here uh i'm walking my neighborhood right now I just left out the house I'm gonna take a walk around the block you know what i actually forgot my phone and i was on the phone with my bro hand i'm always on the phone with my bro hand but uh join join the squad man society of clean ass rides you got to become a part of the squad especially if you own hello I, I walked away from my phone i'm going back to get it right now all right all right yeah if you haven't joined the squad already you got to click that subscribe click that uh click that like drop a comment share my page share my videos this is this is a movement y'all and y'all gonna help me y'all gonna help me grow and the only thing i need from you is tap that subscribe button baby because if you don't it's gonna be all bad you know what i'm saying i need y'all 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 my crew y'all the ones that's gonna go on this journey with me so right now i'm on the phone with my brother i'm always on the phone with my brother me and man we we, we stay hollering at each other so when y'all when y'all see uh on underscore the underscore willfo w-i-l-f-o you understand get on that Play this back so I ain't got to repeat it. Jump on this page. We both trying to get started and we need a little help. And I, but, but you know what? We out here, we working. As y'all can see, I just left out my house. This is, this is how much I drive my car. Real talk. <clears throat> they in my driveway. On the damn trailer. I just came back from I had to drive, I had to unhook my truck and go around the corner to where my van is. My van was sitting on two flats and a dead battery. That's, that's how long ago I drove it. So, <clears throat> always working, always gone, always doing something, always in the wind. And uh, there's a lot of changes that's, that's gonna go down, a lot of them. So, YouTube is one of my changes and I'm putting my heart and soul in it because this is some real shit. So everybody can't do it. I mean, you can, everybody can do it. Let me, let me not say that. Every, anybody can do it, but everybody ain't going to do it because this YouTube shit ain't easy. It ain't something that you just pick up a camera and shoot and then people just jump on you. It, it don't work like that. It's content. So we out here putting out content. And uh, we trying to tune our pages to what we think people want to see most. And uh, I got the cooking thing going on. I actually got some more cooking videos I need to upload so y'all can see. I just cooked my wife breakfast and all that, but I'm gonna get into the omelets, all that. I do all that. And I'm funny about how my, how my food come out, so I can cook. So I'm gonna start doing taste test, little little things and all that. I'm bringing the camera. So if you want to be a part of that, click that subscribe button because I will bring the camera to you and your friends. I'll come cook for y'all. I'll barbecue. I'll do whatever, all free, because this is part of this is part of what I'm doing. So this is this is like my marketing uh, budget. So you you click that subscribe button, get in the list. You automatically in the list when you click that subscribe. In a minute, I'm gonna have where you can join for a, a small fee per month. You don't have to pay. You don't have to, but the way it works is uh, you could be a viewer and that's fine because I love having my viewers, That's we need that. And then there are other people that like to take it to the next level and become part of the exclusive. And see the exclusive stuff, man, I'm still, that's in the works, gotta remember. This is all new. So what I'm gonna be doing on my exclusive stuff, if I come cater or do whatever, 
it'll all be free to my subscriber. The only thing you would have to pay for is alcohol. You have to, I can't, I can't supply alcohol. I can't do none of that. Okay. But everything that I do would be free to you and the, and the group that you choose is going to be a part of the taste test party. Okay. So you wouldn't have to pay for nothing, nothing. I bring the whole show to you. If, if you don't have a place like your home or something that you don't want to show on Facebook, whatever, then we'll do it in another spot of my choosing. Okay. But when I unwrap my food and you taste it, you ain't going to never say, man, that's garbage. Because I don't put out garbage. Straight up. So, like I said, you got to become, a, you got to be, you got to be subscribed. You got to become part of the squad. Join the squad. Right? This is the society right here. So, uh, click on my brother page. Get on that. Subscribe to that. I'm out here walking right now, y'all. I just came from the gym. My big ass finna lose some weight. Because, uh. I can't keep living like this. So I'm taking a walk right now. And uh, I just came back from the gym. I did uh, 20, I actually did 25, well, 24 minutes on the elliptical. Cause I set it for 20 minutes. And uh, then it has that five minute cool down. And I got through about four minutes of that cool down. So I just jumped off. And then I went and did a little bit of abs. I don't want, you know, I can't conquer Rome in one day. So went over there, did some abs. I did like, like 30 crunches. Come here. Stop it. Scarlett, come here. How you doing? Scarlett, come here. Stop. You scared me. But uh, yeah, that's my neighbors. My neighbor, my wife, uh, one of my neighbors just scared his wife. He pulled some kind of prank on her. I want to stop and be nosy, but I'm going to keep it moving. She, she, whatever he did, whatever he did, she, he scared the shit out of her. But, uh, yeah, so this is my neighborhood. This is where I live. Uh, I'm out here in the little, little series, little series, California, right between Modesto and Turlock. Small little, nice little quiet city. And, uh, I got to get some, I got to get some property though. So at some point we're going to move up out of here and, and get a piece of property with some land. I didn't already bought some land, but it's, it's in Lancaster and we don't live down there, but it is a two and a half acre plot in the middle of a residential. So I can like have a home or something built on it or drop a, uh, like a double wide on it or something. I don't know. I was thinking about doing a manufactured home cause they cost less and hell, I ain't going to really never be in it. But if I do, It'd be nice. I'll fix it up real nice and, and all that, but uh, maybe I'll do something like that and rent it out or something. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just my mind is elsewhere right now because I, I would have to still put a septic system in and do some other things to actually get it ready. But that's that's an option and it's down the line. So uh, 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 trying to do what I got to do out here, but switching switching uh changing up changing up careers uh from being in it as long as i've been in it there ain't no joke and it's not a decision that you take lightly so this is this is part of who i am now so i'm finna be in medical billing and the same time uh i'm gonna be doing this youtube thing so i'll show y'all some of the stuff that i'm doing and medical billing but i can't film all the class and all that i don't, don't nobody want to see that but this is a path that i'm choosing for me and my wife and and the situation that we got going on and i think this is going to be a real good one because it's a sound decision and it was made for good reason so uh yeah just just hollering at y'all while i'm out on my little walk y'all can see how quiet it is around here see that check that out it's quiet. Ain't nobody out here. They just repaved all the streets in my neighborhood. So that was one of the reasons. Well, that was actually the main reason that I took my cars off the street and put them on the trailer. It's because they was resurfacing the streets and everybody around here was looking for parks. And uh, and I take up five or six parks out here. So, you know, I got my truck out there. The, the two cars that's on that, the van that's around the corner. And my wife is at work in her car, 
So if I put all them out on the street, <laughs> it's yeah, it's gonna it's gonna take up. It's, people gonna be scrambling. So I just did it a different way. Threw them up on the trailer. We don't really drive them all the time, so they could just stay there until I need the trailer. Whenever I need the trailer, I'll offload them and take the trailer. But for right now, it's gonna leave them up there. Yeah. We ain't driving them anyway. So uh this is this is what's happening, y'all. So I'm gonna be in the studio. I'm a, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop a couple of instrumentals for y'all. I ain't going to play our old music. I'm going to pick about two songs and I'm going to just drop some instrumentals. And what I want y'all to do is uh, film yourself rapping to that shit. Do whatever. Do whatever. If, if it's something cool, it's something cool. If, it, if it's something cool, I'll... I'll uh, I'll feature it on my page. If it's funny, I'll feature it on my page. If you get your kids involved and all that. Okay, I didn't realize that sun was like really directly behind me. Let me see if I can go across here and get a get a better view. But yeah. So I'm out here exercising. I'm finna slam down. I'm finna stop eating all that crap. And uh Cut back on all them sodas and, 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 and goodies and all that, cause real talk, I ain't gotta be, I ain't, I ain't never been this big, to be honest. I just been being lazy. I can show y'all pictures of me. I was thin as the wind. Even in junior high, high school, I wasn't big then either. But when I start driving them trucks, man, let me tell you, <clears throat> them trucks, they, they will make you pick up weight. Real talk. So, been in it a long time, I'm carrying a lot of weight from, from being on them trucks and being inactive and driving and sitting behind the wheel all day and barely getting any good sleep. And uh, now I'm getting older, trucking, has, it, has, it, has, it has treated me well. I've, I've had my ups and downs and all that. And uh, right now, California, they legislating us right out of the business. So I'm good because I got this. And I can I can work even without if hell if I was a quadriplegic I'd still be able to make money because I got my mind I know how to talk I know how to communicate so listen school ain't never been hard anybody that know me know me they know I've always been in the advanced classes <clears throat> so your boy ain't no dummy out here and uh, I got a lot going on but uh. Getting my exercise on. I'm walking around my neighborhood. I don't know if y'all can see how many streets I didn't cross, but I've been walking for a few blocks now. But uh, I just did this on the elliptical and all that. So I wanted to, I'm finna go into my classes. When I get back in the house, I'm signing on to my classes. Uh, right now the class hasn't, well, we had our first session, our first live session online. And, uh, that was just a kind of meet and greet and, you know, ask a few questions about a little bit of the, 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 uh, the units that we've done. And then tomorrow we got another live session. The live sessions are two hours each. Tomorrow we got another live session. And they're gonna be talking to us about a movie that we had to watch and basically characterize the characters in the movie. And, uh, and then there's some other discussions about some other stuff. So basically we're gonna cover unit one and two. We're gonna cover unit one and two. I'm already on unit four. I'm finna go in here, I'm gonna finish unit four tonight. I'm gonna finish unit five and six, probably, hell, I can do that tonight too. It just depends on how I feel like, if I really feel good about reading. That's why I'm out here walking because I wanna get my, my blood flowing and all that. I don't wanna just sit on the couch after running all day. So they said exercise will make you think better and make you last longer. So I'm exercising, I'm taking it seriously. I'm not, I'm not leaving nothing to chance. This is a career change for me. So I'm gonna take this career change and I'm gonna make the best out of it. When I tell y'all, I'm gonna get straight A's. They said this is a one year class and they expect everybody to pass it in, within 10 months or whatever. So we'll take our exam and in 10 months, we'll all be certified medical coders. And uh, 
I'm going to finish this class in like six months. If, if, if I can talk to my mentor, because we got mentors and we have class instructors. So you got all these, all this support. And they say it's a learn at your own pace type of thing, but I pick up stuff really fast and I get bored if something is like, it's, it's dragging me. If, if I got to sit there and I got to wade through a bunch of stuff that I already know, I'll get bored. But I do understand what needs to be done. So it ain't like I'm going to get bored and quit. I just don't want the class to be boring to me. So uh, I'm going to try to work as fast as I can. I don't want to work so fast I don't actually pick it up. But I do want to work fast and get it done. And I don't know if they'll allow me. But if I can, uh, my mentor did say she's had people that'll that'll finish the class in six months. That's my goal. Now, she say, hey, if you can do it in four, I'll be shooting for four months. So it's a lot of stuff we got to learn. I don't claim to know everything, but I'm a fast learner. So I just click on every piece of info that they send. I click on every link. I do everything, even if it says... This won't be graded and it's optional. I'm doing all the optional stuff too. When I graduate, whether I graduate in 10 months or six months or four months, I plan on having straight A's all the way through. From now, all the way to the end of the course, no matter what I gotta go through to get there, I plan on having straight A's when I'm done and I'm gonna shoot and I know it's high, I get it, but I'm gonna shoot for 100% accuracy on the exam if I get 98 97 99 if I get whatever if I pass I'm gonna be good but I don't expect to pass with no average grade or no average score I don't want no average so I want to be at the top of the class if not at the top of the class the top dog at the class I don't claim I don't know what other people are it's like they pick 400 people so I'm, I'm sure there's some pretty intelligent people that are in this course and I'm sure there's some people that probably ain't so intelligent and they gonna do whatever they can and they probably gonna figure out that it ain't for them and and they'll let go and ain't nothing wrong with that because you got to try so you can even see if it's for you everybody that got picked it's not gonna make it I mean we know it ain't, it ain't gonna be a hundred percent success rate it never is so uh, there'll be some people that'll drop out I promise you I won't be one of them and uh, at the end of this course, straight out of school, because of this program that I'm in, uh, when I leave school, I'll come into the field with two years experience. So I will not have an A on my CPC certificate. The A means, well, I feel like I dropped something just now. Okay, sorry about that. But A means apprentice. So your, your certificate will say CPC-A. And that's letting everybody in the industry know that you're an apprentice, that you just finished school, that you're looking to be trained. A lot of these companies don't want to train nobody. They want trained people. So when I finish the course, I'll have two years experience. I will not have an A next to my, next to my, my certification. So... Uh, I'll just come out as a certified coder. So I'll just have a CPC certificate. And uh, I'll go straight into the field. Uh, and I'll start somewhere between 40, 50. I could be at 51 or something like that. But I, I think it's going to be somewhere around 51. But don't don't knock me. Don't, don't mark me. I'm getting information from different source, sources and all that. So it could be a little less. It could be a little more. But it's in that neighborhood. With that, oh, I could do it. Cause most of the stuff that that I didn't did and all that is pretty much paid for. Still got some stuff out here that need to be paid for, but that'll put me more. That'll put me way in the range of, of paying all that stuff off. So that should that shouldn't be a problem. The bottom line is your boy is out here. Don't forget that. So I've been running my mouth, walking the neighborhood. You see, I'm back at home. I'm finna run in here get on my lessons so y'all support your boy hit that subscribe button let people know i'm 47 years old so if you're a youngster out there and you're struggling go back to school get retrained do something different figure it out i'm 47 i'm, fi I'm figuring it out right now and, and i don't have no problem i'm glad to get out that ain't no pump 
them big rigs, they ain't no joke. So I'm I'm glad to get out and be able to go into something that's gonna make me some decent money and all that. So I'm good. And then I'm not stopping there. Oh, I got plans. You subscribe, you'll get the content, you'll see what's happening. But you gotta become a member. You gotta you gotta you gotta you gotta be a subscriber. You gotta help your boy out. And I and I and I'll show y'all everything that I got going on, what I'm doing, and it might just you know inspire you to get out there and make some changes if you feel like you need to make some changes everybody can do what i'm doing and i ain't doing nothing i'm just out here working hard that's that's what i'm doing so uh i like to be an inspiration i'm an aries I, you know i run my mouth that's what i do i do that good and 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 the, the, the thing is everybody needs support so this is what i'm doing i get the subscribers i bring y'all more content i bring y'all more content i go further out but I'm not coming empty handed. I'm coming, I'm coming with a wealth of experience and knowledge. There's a lot of people that do what I do and I can spread that, I can teach that, I can be a part of that. This medical billing, this is just another part of my life that I'm finna get into and it's, to me it's gonna be lovely because I love numbers. Numbers just, they, they rattle around in my head all day and I love that. I mean, I, I love the feeling of, of computing and, and coming up with solutions and, and, and coding and doing different things I, I love numbers anybody that know me know that so this is gonna be good for me i think so i'm gonna get into my lesson before i end this video i want to say thank you for your support up front but just know it don't never stop it don't never stop i need all the subscribers i can get i need y'all to share this video share it with your kids let them see that this is what you got to do if you do it when you are young you don't have to make career changes well, I, I can't say that, but if you do, you already know that there are people out here that's making career changes and doing things, so you don't have to be scared. Get in there, dig in, get into your lessons and be the best, so when you come out, you can get the top spots. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's dog eat dog out here. So, I'm a shark, you know what I'm saying? I'm the big dog. I'm, I'm the one that, 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 that you gonna wanna be and wanna see, but I need help too. But anyway, y'all, like, subscribe, share, comment. If you like what you like what you've seen in this video, man, I'll keep them coming.